Hi, good morning, class 3. Good morning, everyone. Please take your seat. How are you? Fine. Okay, now today I'm going to teach English, okay, for first week. That is chapter 1, okay. T please take out your English book, everyone. Okay, now look here, okay. First, listen to the story, okay. So, the story I have divided into two parts, okay. Because it is very long. So, this is, today I am going to teach for first week, chapter 1, how the camel got its hum. Part, part A, part A, okay? Please look here everyone. Okay, and listen the story nicely, okay? Okay, it is, it is written here, how the camel got its hum. We will going to know how the camel got its hum. Hum means, suppose this is what? Think this is camel, okay? And hum means this upper part. Is called, this part is called what? Hum. Have you seen camel? Yeah, some of them you have seen, but some of you, you have not seen. But you have seen in where? Yes, in movies, okay? You have seen in? movies. So, please listen the story nicely, okay? It is written here, long ago, there live a camel, okay? Long ago, there live a, what? Camel. Where? In the middle of the howling desert. Okay, where do camel live? In the middle of the howling desert. So, the camel was what? Very lazy means he don't want to do any work, okay? So, each day he spent, the camel spent what? Eating what? Sticks, stones, tamarix, milkweed and prickles. What do the camel eat? Sticks, stones, milkweed, prickle and tamarix. So, one day, what happened? A horse came to a camel, okay, and asked, why he is not working? What did the camel say? The camel did not say any word. Just he said hum. Okay? What did the camel say? Only hum. And he did, he did not say any word. Okay? So, the horse went away. Okay? Now, on Tuesday, again, one animal came. That animal is what? A dog. A dog came with sticks in his mouth and asked the camel why he is not fetching water. Okay? So, what did the camel say? The camel again did not say any word. Just he said what? Hum. Okay? And by hearing that word, the dog went away. Okay? Now, the next on Wednesday, again one more animal came. That is the ox. The ox came with yolk on his neck. So yolk, Y-O-K-E. Yolk means what? The wooden bar. Okay. The wooden bar put on the neck of the ox while plowing. Okay. So, the ox also came and asked the camel why he is not working. So, the camel did not say any word. He repeated the same word by saying hum and went away. Okay? So, in the evening, the men called the three animals. The horse, the dog and the ox. And told them to do double work because they have to fill up the work of the camel. So, by hearing that words, when the owner told the man to do, when the owner told the three animals to work double times, they got very angry. So, what they do? What they did? They decided to have health meeting. Okay? 
and discuss what to be done with the camel. Okay? So, one day, while they were having meeting, the camel also saw that they were discussing about him. But he did not, the camel did not pay any attention to that meeting and he just left and he went away. Okay? So, uh, today we will dis uh, discuss up to here only. Next time we will in part, in part B we will discuss the details story. How the camel got its harm. Okay? So, from here, have you have understood the story? Which I have told just now? Yes. Can you answer if I give any questions? Yes. So, where did a camel live? Can you say everyone? Say loudly. Yes, the camel live in the middle of the howling desert. Yes. Who came on Monday? To a camel? Who came? Yes, a horse. On on Wednesday? Who came? Say loudly, loudly. So that everyone can hear. Yes, the ox came. Okay. So, you have understood the story, no? So, the remaining parts we will discuss in next class. Okay? Thank you class. Enough for today, okay? We'll discuss in next class. Bye.